Hockey. Good evening, everyone. Pats and Broncos will battle at the Brand Center tonight. Both teams have beat each other in one goal games. We're China with an overtime victory after being down 3 0 in the first period. Now, Julie Stewart Binks is at the Brand Center with a man who actually has connections to both teams. Julie? Yes, there is one connection between these two teams, and that's Jamie Hewer, the former Regina Pat, who is now the director of player development and assistant coach for the Swift Current Broncos. Now, Jamie, with this new job that you have, you just came into it. Can you tell us a little bit more about it? Um, it's basically what it the, the description says it all. I'm, I'm going to be a part-time assistant coach when I'm around the team. And then when I'm not and they're on the road, I'm going to go and see their, their young guys, the list guys, um, try to get a feel for how the young players operate. And uh, when I'm around, be on the ice and, and just kind of give the coaches some help. Yeah, now looking at your team, you've only had one regulation loss so far in the season. It's been a good start. What's it all come down to? Why are things working? You know, they've got a pretty good core. Um, picked up a really good goaltender. Uh, Laura Kynan has been spectacular so far. Good young defense. Um, you know, they move the puck well. They, they do a lot of good things. And we've got some guys up front that just love to play. Uh, they play hard every night. Uh, you know, Mark has a system, and he's got a, a, a team that's dedicated to play the way he wants, and, and things are going well. Now let's talk a little bit more about that goaltender E2, Laura Kynan. From the CHL import draft, it's not only his first year with your team, but his first year within the league and within the country. Why has he been so successful so far? He's a very confident guy. Um, you know, he's played at a high level over in Finland. Uh, you know, coming over here, it's, it's almost like he's, uh, it really wasn't a step down or up for him. Um, you know, he's played at a parallel level. And he's, he's a very confident kid. You know, you talk to him, you work with him, and, you know, everything that you say to him just kind of sinks in, and he works hard, and, and he's, uh, you know, he's a battler out on the ice. He, he doesn't give up on rebounds, and he's just, he's just been really good for us so far. Well, it should be interesting tonight. Obviously, two teams that are very tight in the standings, only two points and a one-goal affair for the last two games. So thanks very much, Jamie. Good luck tonight and for the rest of the season. Thank you. Now, we have just one game note tonight. Dryden Hunt from the Regina Pats back on the ice. He was sidelined with concussion system, uh, sorry, concussion symptoms for the last nine games. So we'll have to see how he does tonight against the Swift Current Broncos. All right. Thanks, Julie. Of course, Julie, of all the highlights and post-game reaction on late sports. All right. The football now and a playoff spot is on the line for the